What's up, guys? To start off the 37th episode of the Iron Hide series, we just got 96 fishing. Uh, I figured I'd start off with uh, some AFK fishing today. I played quite a bit of Call of Duty and whatnot. Um, but yeah, I did 436k fishing XP today. As you can see, we'll pull that on over there. Uh, so not too bad. Just decided to do this. I'll probably go do my Cerberus task here in a bit. I am currently watching the 100. So... Uh, great show so far. Let's go jump into some Cerberus. Before I go to Cerberus, I did calculate out that I need to buy... So I need 103,799 coal. And I do not even have 30k coal. So I have a lot of coal buying to do. It, I don't know how long it's going to take. I haven't calculated how much I can buy per hour. Uh, I do have a coal bag, obviously, from doing that much motherload mine. Uh, so as... As far as I'm aware, this is the fastest way without actually doing more mining because I have no intentions of actually doing that. Uh, I probably should have thought about this before I went and did all of it at Motherload Mine, but it's okay. We'll end up just doing it here. And uh, yeah, so I'll be doing this intermittently while I watch like Netflix and stuff. I don't want to make this clip too long. Let's hop into some Cerberus. Alright, kill number 300 at Cerberus. So my second kill back. And we get an unholy symbol. Oh, we just got the Pegasian Crystal. Nice. Kill count 311 and we have all of the crystals. We don't have a Smoldering Stone. But we now have all the crystals. That's really dope. And I'm just going to kind of stand under here. I need to go get Ranger Boots. So I guess we'll do that this episode as well. Alright, so I decided I won't be doing any more Cerberus after this kill. Just because I have the drops I need from here. I really don't need a Smoldering Stone. And I don't really plan on pet hunting, to be honest. So... This is kind of just a waste of supplies at this point. I'm just going to get this kill, and I will go finish up this task at Hellhounds. I want to see how many points I have so I can get the Superior Slayer unlocked. And, uh, yeah, so I'll come back once I finish up this kill. And the loot is Soul Runes. All right, let's go finish up this task. All right, so right now I'm going to unlock the Superior Slayer, and I'm also going to unlock the... Uh, Lizard Shamans as well, so I can eventually start going for the uh, Dragon Warhammer. And uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it. I'm gonna buy a bunch of Slayer things. Here we go. Need to go make some more rings. Okay, there is 97 fishing. Only two more levels to go. 98 fishing. Alright, so I decided to come back to Monkfish to finish up 99 fishing, and there we go boys, let's go get the cape, and move on to woodcutting because I still have exams this week. 95 woodcutting. There is 96 woodcutting. Alright, so after a ton of charging air orbs, <laughs> I had to make 25k cosmic runes, and I charged 6k air orbs, so that is now going to go with our battle staffs. I do not have enough yet though, so I need to go make some more cosmic runes and charge the rest of the orbs. Alright guys, I just finished my semester a few days ago, it is now the weekend afterwards, and I'm kind of going to go on a little talking spree here while we're doing lovely collecting seaweed. So I'll put an annotation on the screen for where to skip through to get out of this if you don't feel like sitting and listening to it. But basically I'll be explaining what my current plans are, what my future will look like for YouTube, and uh, streaming now. So, I won't be taking any classes in the spring because there is actually nothing for me to take. I'm a nursing major currently, and I don't have any more classes I can take until I finish uh, a national exam I got to take, and then I have to do an eight-week class where I'm actually inside a nursing home taking care of patients and whatnot. So until I get those two done, I cannot take any more classes, and I'll actually be applying for uh, more clinical classes like that. So, I don't know if I've really gone into too much detail about what my major was and whatnot, but yeah, that's what I'm currently doing. And for that, um, it has been an, ex it's an extremely tough major as it is. So, I've been busting my ass studying 8 to 10 hours a day for pretty much the last month. So, that's why the RuneScape gains have been basically fishing, mining, and woodcutting. I'm sure you guys could figure that out uh, by just the boring content as it was. Uh, with that being said... Uh, raids come out in a few weeks, I believe, two to, uh, about three weeks or so. So I'm going to be grinding my stats, getting ready for that. But on top of that, I really want to get my God Wars Dungeon stuff out of the way as well. 
So I'm planning on streaming that. But yeah, I just kind of want to explain that I'll actually be able to get a set schedule out pretty soon. And the best way to find out when I'm streaming or what I'm currently working on doing is to follow me on Twitter. Obviously, I'll leave that down in the description. It's usually in there every video, but I don't really talk about it too much. Um, but yeah, so that's kind of my plan right now is to start streaming God Wars Dungeon. I did a lot of um, like preparation. I have a lot of food made, a lot of bones to peaches tabs, a lot of tabs made for teleporting. And basically just getting everything ready. But this weekend I kind of wanted to just calm down, relax. I've been busting my ass over school, so I figured I'd do a lot of skilling stuff and working on knocking out 2200 total level. So I made 6.1k air orbs. We have... I'll need to make some more cosmic runes, it won't take that long. Um, then make all these in the battle staffs, I'll eventually alk all of them. I have to start on my gold ore for smithing, which isn't too terrible. Uh, what else did I do? I started doing su uh, some Slayer again. I got two Superior Slayer Blood Velds, and I didn't get anything from them. I didn't use the clip because I was still working on fixing the microphone quality, and the clip was just absolutely horrible, so I didn't bother putting it in. But anyway, just kind of want to give you guys a little update. Uh, I guess I'll come back when I'm, whenever I get a level or something like that. But for the next few days, I think I'm going to focus on just finishing up some skilling. I plan on getting 99 fletching here pretty shortly. And uh, after I do some smithing and whatnot, as well as the crafting. So, uh, kind of just wanted to give you guys an update. So, I will put the end of the annotation here, if you did skip through. I don't blame you, kind of some boring shit in there, but uh, kind of had to be done. So that was just the beginning of my seaweed collecting. I made all the other air orbs, and we now have the equal amount to our battle stab. So, I will end up making these now. I still need to get more coal for the rest of these ores. I do need to knock out all the gold ore in first that's what i'll probably do and then move on to the rune or to the addy or whatever but um yeah my buckets of sand have been adding up for a while so i need to collect over 8k seaweed uh so i think i'm gonna rewatch breaking bad let's go get it all right well i just knocked out 2.5 mil smithing xp in a day and a half there is 92 smithing we also have 2200 total level so that's really nice eventually someday hopefully the 2200 total worlds will be repolled, and maybe it'll pass, probably won't because most people can't get on those worlds, but yeah, anyway, I still have 11k gold ore to go, so we still have at least another level banked, and then I'll start working on the rune bars, and then we'll go collect some seaweed, I can't wait for that, it's gonna be a lot of Breaking Bad, and I actually did start doing some rune crafting again, only 260k away, and then, or from 91, and then I'll start doing nature runes, so I can finally get all of the gnats I need banked for our alking and uh, bones to peaches and a bunch of different shit. Alright, well I figured I'd come back to show you guys, this is the end of the gold ore, so this did almost get me to 93, I'm only 28k off of 93, and yeah, I got about 184 to 185k XP per hour. I know it's not the best, but I, would, I did take a break in between. Because this is a lot of freaking clicking, man. Uh, like, I got hungry and shit. Here, I'll show you guys the XP right there. So, 765.3k smithing XP uh, just in this session. So, I went hard, and that is finally done. So, now let's get on to the rune ore. Alright, you guys are going to fucking hate me for all the Blast Furnace clips, but I just finished all 48k coal. That we have 46k, 48k, whatever. Look at all those bars, man. 4.3k rune bars. And then 12.3k addy bars. That's a shit ton of XP. And I'm probably going to be making a bunch of dart tips with all the addy. I don't plan on using the rune until that is the last set of bars that I have left in the bank. I need to go buy over... Uh, God, I think it's close to 50k coal. And currently the shops are being... Coal is being sold to the shops. So I can't buy it because of other Iron Man being douchebags. So... I don't know when I'll do that. Alright, let's go do some fun shit. There is 99 fletching. Let's go do some medium clues and see if we can go get our ranger boots. Alright, so currently I'm at Piro Piro working on getting my ranger boots. And I just spotted a lucky impling here. Hopefully I can catch it really quickly. Ah, son of a bitch. Be right back. Stay, motherfucker. Yeah, lucky impling. What a fuck... Alrighty, that is our third pair of fucking wizard boots. <laughs> oh, come on, I cannot get lucky, man. What is this? This is our fourth pair of holy sandals.
All right, so I decided I'm going to be going for 500 medium clue scrolls or if I get ranger boots prior to that. Uh, that's kind of what I'll be doing for the next probably day or so. And I really don't plan on showing too many of the loots besides if I get any type of boots because in my opinion, it makes the videos really boring if it's a bunch of shitty loots over and over and over again. Uh, but yeah, you'll hear from me if I get boots and I'll also be moving on to something else when I get 500 uh, medium clue scrolls done. Alright, I've done 49 clue scrolls today, and we have not gotten dick, man. About to hit 500 medium clues, and uh, let's see if we can pull out this surprise ranger boots. And here is to hopes and dreams of getting ranger boots on 500 medium clue scrolls. A Zami page. Damn, it looks good, but it's really unfortunate at the same time. Uh, yeah, I'm done with medium clue scrolls for a little while. I did 145 in a three-day period, I believe. Yeah, three days. Um, so I'm going to call this a video, guys. I am actually going to be around pretty often. So I will be hopefully making more videos like on a regular basis now, like once a week or something like that, where I can actually do quite a bit of progress i'll be bossing more and it won't be dead ass boring skills i also have two dragon implings 13 ninjas and 31 magpies that i caught while just doing everything i didn't catch everything i saw but i figured whenever i finish bando's boots and i can start doing other shit uh clue scroll wise i'll be able to farm some easy like uh hard clue scrolls and maybe get a lucky elite off of one of those dragon implings but that's uh i'm pretty exhausted and, uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like, favorite, subscribe if you're new. And until next time, guys, thank you very much for watching. Peace out.